there's always highs and there's always lows and it seems like the lows make the highs that much better. And it's just unbelievable, man. I like the sound of that. First time I've had a bow in my hand in you know, three, four years. I'm supposed to have some fun. Your name, amen. 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 Your sensibilities are the rules that make a society want to misbehave, want to set you free. I want to break you. Thank you, brother. <laughs> oh. And I've heard you talking to the moon. It's just the team of guys that we have is just pretty epic. If there's any way that we can inspire people to enjoy the outdoors and hunting and anything like that, that's at the top of the list for me. Van Halen, not Van Hagar. Try it. Huh? There's a bull right there. Go kill it. I'm, I'm the shooter. You are the shooter. Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna short stand. You just. Oh, tomorrow's Get my soon. tomorrow's my birthday. That's when I really want to be shooter. Oh yeah, happy birthday. That's tomorrow. Oh, that's right. Don't waste happy it. Happy birthday. Even up my mess. How do you feel about bugling bull down in the canyon? Well, it, yeah, I'm pretty excited about it, uh, but uh, I think we have the wind at our backs again. <laughs> <laughs> we did hear something over here. I'm hoping that if we blow that opportunity, we can circle back and maybe go after this one. But this right here was one of the best experiences that I've had so far, just being out here and uh, hanging out, it was, it was really fun. Had a great view behind us. And right here is, uh, is an experience that I'm good with, even if I don't get a bull. Yeah. Tell you the truth, it's been pretty fun.
Where's the elk you heard over here, Joe? Me, it's me. Just a little, little bit, little little bit further. Little further. This bugle can really carry. There's a little frost on the pumpkin this morning for the first, uh, second time this entire year. Chase just told me we'd better not hear a bugle down there. Told him this is my hunt of a lifetime. Take it serious. And by that I mean I'd rather hear a bugle somewhere else. Started day two. Well, I heard the bull about one o'clock this morning, and it sounds like he was down the face a little bit further, kind of, kind of where he was last night. Um, but there was a lot of commotion, a lot, a lot of commotion. And when vehicles with stock trailers and stuff come down this road, it is freaking loud and it echoes everywhere. And the camp down the road running generators all night long, it just echoes up to this canyon, but. This hillside is tore up with sign. So, I mean, that wasn't him. Um, <laughs> there's just, I don't know. I mean, there's a ton of elk sign we saw probably a 
over 50 rubs last night on that one ridge, but we just bumped into a couple little raghorns and um, a couple cows. So I just don't know if these elk move a lot. I mean, we did 10 and a half miles last night. Didn't see a lot of elk, so we're gonna, we're just gonna give this phase one last try this morning, and then um, we're gonna get in the side by side and go check out some new country. He might go though. Gonna be a close shot. find him and then figure out how to play the wind. First spot was no response, so we're moving on. Gonna keep road bugling, I think. I don't know what we're doing. Steve, what are we doing? We're gonna go find elk. Oh. That's exactly all we're gonna do. Okay. That means you might have to hike more than 10 yards from the truck, so. Uh, that's, I'm out. Right. I'm out. I know you are. <laughs> if we can't bugle them to the cat roads, then why even bother? what I deal with every day. You're welcome. I know. Well, we just got a bugle in the bottom. So we've got about two hours. Yeah. But the wind's perfect, right? Really now. good. So yeah, we're just gonna pull out the maps and figure out like sound like you a straight light right in. Right in it is straight down. Hey, that's where they are. The elk are exactly where you find them. That's right. We thought where we knew they should be. Yep, we just gotta drop in and keep the wind right and see if we can get them to play. <laughs> Sounds like fun. <laughs>
guys, it's our last day here on the, the tag. This is day five, last day. So we got Steve and Trent calling for us. We got Noah with me, running the camera. And uh, we're just gonna go out and find one, make it happen. Thanks for following along this whole season with us, guys. Land of the free, it's been a good one. Yeah, let's get her done today. Give up the thought, give up the thought. I've heard you talking to 